Welcome to Mobile Electronic Diagnostic. Uh, this is Muhammad Harun Idris uh, on Best Car Fixes. Please subscribe, share, and like here. Today we have my friend. Uh, he have a 2007 BMW with uh, no startability and a steering lock sign on the dashboard. He has this problem for how long? About almost like three, four months now. Like three, four months, and he Googled all over the world, tried to get some solution, and he got my video, one of my videos. Um, hopefully, this will help you fix your car. You may need a scanner or uh, some kind of diagnosis. There is a lot of uh, diagnosis tool there. Uh, Snap-on can do it. Uh, Hotel can do it. And uh, the original dealer tools will do it. So here is a car. Let's go together. Beautiful blue color. I love it. Okay, now let's go ahead. I am going to use uh, a Snap-on scanner, which is there. And the battery is already charged. We got a brand new battery which is here. Sometime you disconnect this uh, wire here. You see the battery sensor wire? Uh -huh. Sometime if you disconnect it also, the car will start. Uh, you see this, this wire here? Come here and here. It will start, but if not, now we have a brand new battery. Let's go ahead and see if we can um, go in and do the reset for a steering lock control module or a steering lock. Okay, you see here? That is the sign. The sign will give us headache. There is a bypass also that you can disconnect the steering lock control module, which is inside the steering column, and then you plug it in, code it, and it will work. But let us right now go and see this why this sign here, which prevent the car from uh, cranking or start. Sometimes this sign is yellow, sometimes it's red, but either way, I'm using uh, this tool here. Okay, I'm using this uh, this tool here, and I will put the key in the ignition, or you don't put it, it's the same, but I'm going to put the key in the ignition also. Hopefully, we will be okay. Now, you see nothing, only the airbag sign. That means the algorithm or the password that being correspond or sent between the key module and the engine computer, it gets lost. It's just like someone who have uh, you know, a stroke pass out or your phone dead and you lost the password, you have to put it back again. I just want to give you a little bit of, you know, like to understand. Now I'm going to go to my scanner. Okay. And I got to put the hazard light on. Be sure your battery is fully charged. You see, I connect it to the OBD2. This is a wireless snap-on. Snap-on have a lot of software there. Now I'm going to go to uh, BMW. Where is a BMW here? Okay, this car is parked almost three months. Vehicle selection, and then it's 2007, right? This is for most of three series, five series automatic identification. I put the hazard light on. Hopefully, I will be able to pull the VIN number. Sometime also, the windows will not work anymore. The cast module, I mean the footwell module, will forget. Also, the functionality of the windows and headlights. But because the car is sitting here for a long time, let's go ahead and see. We try to read the information. We are able to read it. Three series, E92, E93. Good. I'm able to read the information from cast module. Let me close the door from the noise. Does beeping have to stop? Now, what do you need to do? Hmm. I am going to go into where let me go to the cast module Imush, engine uh, electronic immobilizer and cast continue hopefully now here look if there is any code you're gonna see like code uh, code related to control unit fault you see a0 apple apple or a0 b5 road speed signal that could be with the abs pass control unit fault i'm gonna go back here and then i will go to clear code i'm not sure if this code will be cleared continue also let's go, yeah that's the only code we have so let me go back again to the engine control module which it will not be possible to get an engine control you see the the the, the lock is there uh, I may not be able to communicate with the engine because the ignition is not on. If I get the engine, I will be happy. Let me see the codes. You see, 
Diagnostic, uh, diagnostic module tank leak, DMTL, oil, map, power, vanus. So we are communicating with the engine control module. Now let me go to uh, functional test, a special function. We have battery replacement or EVAP. I don't know what they mean by battery replacement. That's not the, the, what we need here. Register battery. You can register battery with this tool also. I don't want to do that. Is there any return? I don't see no return. Go to scanner. Just display history. Then close. No. Close. Yes. I want to go back. Exit for battery register. This is not the place. I believe we have to go back to service reset. I don't need that one also. Let me go back to uh, to my immobilizer. Continue. Sorry to take long. Now, let me go to function test. Under the function test, you're going to see special function. Leave this one. Go to special function. Now we have car, cars resynchronization, lock and enable master key ELF, ELV, fall counter reset. This is our mission here. You go to this one here. If you have a car like this, go to any mechanic who have snap-on like Virus with the capability and tell him do this one for me. Now continue. The following procedure will carry out the ELV counter Full counter reset. I'm going to continue. In progress. In progress. Hopefully everything going to be okay. I hear something. The internal electric steering column lock fault counter has been reset successfully. I am very happy for that. Say continue. Please cycle the ignition to complete procedure after uh, to complete procedure after service function clear code in the control module. Now I'm gonna do this one. Take this one out. Stop the other light. How long it takes? Seven minutes, seven thirty something minutes. We're gonna wait. Are you ready, my friends? Thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe, share, and like. And also try to give us any idea that help our uh, our page or our YouTube channel uh, grow up. Also, if you are in Facebook, please visit my YouTube channel. And if you are in, in YouTube, also visit my Facebook and we take it from there. I'm going to put the key inside. You see there, 41 coming. I don't see the sign. I'm going to push one button. Are you, get, are you there, all of you? One, two, three, four, nothing. Okay, go again out. Put it back. Okay. It doesn't want to go out. I don't see the. It's supposed to work. Because I did it. Let me see. Star, star interlock. That's not nothing have to do with what we did. Synchronized cast. This is not possible, but okay. I don't see the sign anymore. Don't tell me my battery is weak. Nothing is there. Okay, let me try it again. Maybe this freeze.
we did everything maybe maybe we have a problem I cannot say the battery is weak because everything is on now and there is no code for that anymore let me go back to codes control unit fault I don't believe that control unit is fault but uh, so they have some calls coming please let me see I don't see anything now but Exit. Clear quotes. Complete. Let me see if any quote. No quote present. Okay. Now, is my battery dead? Yeah, it looks like the battery is weak. That's why I cannot do anything. Believe me, now I know. Okay, uh, we're gonna wait a little bit. So it looked like that battery is very weak and that it doesn't help us to do anything. I'm gonna try to put a battery charger or anything that can help us. It looked like the battery have an issue. So. Yeah, you have a jumper cable? Yeah. Yeah, I gotta bring my car here now. Okay, this th that is a connection where we can put the jump jumper. See if we will be able to get it. If it's not, maybe I have to go out. Put something there. Is your cable can reach from there to here? Look here where the this one is this side. Is the cable long enough? If it's not, is there any access from the other side? This is very short. This one here we need to get the car. Try it first. If you can reach there. So at least if I'm able, okay. I'm gonna put this one here. I'm gonna put the other one there. Uh oh. Why? You join it there? Separate them from there. Thank you. Now, it reach? It doesn't reach? Okay, if it doesn't reach, I have to move back and come back near. Okay, let me go back and come near to you like this. 